So baseball teams officially have a week to decide what they want to do with a player, whether it's when you're his, uh, release and blah, 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 or trade when they DFA somebody. And the Yankees DFA Lucas Lickey a week ago, one of the more dependable left-handed relief pitchers. And they finally made a decision. They've, they've traded him to the Atlanta Braves, and they got two prospects in return. They got Indigo Diaz, who's a 24-year-old, uh, big right-handed pitcher, six foot five, 250 pounds, and their double-A affiliate. He went 3-4 and four with a 3.01 ERA, 3.08 ERA, 63 strikeouts in 49 innings pitched. So looks like he's got a big arm. That's the one guy. The other guy is Caleb Durbin, who's an infield prospect in their high A affiliate, 22 years old. And he batted 241 and 382 at bats, 8 homers, 62 RBIs with 31 stolen bases. So he's got some speed, okay, an OPS of 724. So some solid intangibles for each one of these players. And again, more minor league depth at this point. Um, and again, this the, 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 uh, Durbin especially, he could come in handy maybe if they happen to trade a bunch of infielders because the Yankees are not done yet. They have more moves to make. And my, my gut's telling me, and again, I could be wrong, my gut's telling me that they're going to trade a couple of infielders one way or another. Um, whether it be, well, we don't know. I think they're just going to trade a couple infielders, minor league and major league level. And guys like this will help replenish some depth. Even if he's at the lower level right now, they have some guys, you know, at the upper levels as well to kind of replace some of the guys that are going to be re- potentially replaced shortly. So, but I wanted to get this news to you out there. The Yankees are not done making moves and, um, you know, there's still more stuff to happen here in the Yankee world. So be sure to subscribe to the channel, if you, particularly if you're a Yankee fan or you're a baseball fan in general and you just don't want to miss this type of content. I don't want you to miss out on it, and uh, I want to get it to you when it comes out as well. So this stuff just broke. It's on MLBTradeRumors.com as well, and it's kind of all over the place right now. And let's see let's see which beat writer kind of uh, released this one. Um, nobody yet. But I'm sure Jeff Passan and the rest of them are going to be talking about it shortly. They'll be tweeting about it and everything else. So, but it's on MLBTradeRumors.com, which is one of the more uh, accurate websites for information, particularly in the Major League Baseball world. So, um, but that's what I got for you right now. Check out the other videos I put out earlier. Um, there's a whole bunch of other stuff that I, a whole bunch of other moves that have been made, and um, I don't want you to miss out on any of that either. So, um, I'll keep it coming one way or another. We're going live on Friday night. We'll keep it coming. Keep the info train rocking and rolling your direction. Talk to you later.